Hey guys, this is Eliminator786. Today's video is going to be a tutorial video on how to make a Crazy Craft server. Uh, Crazy Craft 3.0, uh, 3.0 to be more exact. Um, I had a lot of difficulty with this, and I probably don't know any of the bugs that you have. I don't have any of the bugs you have, but I'm going to show you the step to step process of how to install it and blah blah blah, what you need to do. And like, I got a bug too, and I'll show you how to fix that bug maybe if you get it. So let's get right into it. So first you want to make a new folder. You can call it whatever you want for your server. It's going to be a server folder. I'll just make a test server video. I already made a crazy crash server right there. And I don't want to uh, mess with it too much. But I'll just show you everything you need to do. Then you want to go to here. I'm going to search. Sorry. I'm going to search crazy craft 3.0. Find the one that voids wrath. Click that. Scroll down. Uh, download the server pack. You're also gonna need, of course, if you hopefully you know, you're gonna need either WinRAR or seven, WinRAR or seven, seven zip to unzip all these files. That's pretty much all you need. So once this is done, I'm using WinRAR. If you don't know, uh, first open, close that, extract to find the server, uh, the folder you made. Okay, it'll take uh, some time. I, I have a pretty good computer, so it won't take too long. So, while, also, <laughs> let me say this: you're gonna need a port forward, but I already port forwarded. Um, I can make a video, guys, a video guy, if you guys want, but um, it's gonna be on my router and not your router, so so it might help, but it might not help. So you know, maybe. And also, if this works or at least helps, please subscribe and like. It really uh, means a lot. Okay, so you wanna press X. Go back to your thing. So this is your server. Here's your um, we're gonna run the server, start your server, do all our stuff. So I'm on Windows. Hopefully you know this is Windows 10, by the way. But hopefully you know this is Windows. And if for the people that are watching on Mac, you're gonna use this. And so whatever gig, like how much RAM you have. So I have eight gigabyte RAM, but it just for some reason it won't let me do it. So I'll do a six gigabyte RAM. So I recommend doing it what so whatever RAM you have in like two lower. So if you have 36, the oh, 24, the one lower than that. So for Mac users, I guess you would click, double click this and run it. But for Windows, I'll show you, you're gonna click this. Double click that, hopefully this won't mess my other server up. But then you're gonna press run. And I'm gonna close that so it doesn't ruin it. And what would happen is I'm gonna go to my regular server. Let me just get rid of this. So you go to your regular server. And the first time you run it, First time you run it, it'll do. It'll, be, it'll become really glitchy, and then it'll just stop. And you're not gonna have like you only have two files. And what you want to do is it'll just stop. And I'm gonna close this. And what you're gonna have here, you're gonna go back to crazy, and you're gonna have a uh, Eula text. So then you're just gonna click that. It'll say false. You're gonna just ex uh, take away that false and put true in, and then uh, you know save that, go back, and then launch it again, and it should work perfectly fine. I recommend if this doesn't work and you keep trying, try all these fixes, like change Java. Right now I'm on Java 7. There's so many fixes, just like try all the fixes. You keep trying them, keep trying. I recommend just Googling how to fix this, blah, blah, blah. Look at old CrazyCraft 2.2 servers, how to fix those, blah, blah, blah. And if that none of this works, this might work for you. I don't, it worked for me. Is you're, It's not like this is not working, right? So I just do, just delete it. Boom. Drag and drop in the recycling bin and delete it. And then just reinstall it. So that that's what fixed my uh, thing. It says something about like AMT Windows. It's really buggy because it just came out like I don't know a couple weeks ago. And that's pretty much it on how to make a server for Crazy Craft 2.2. You let me. You want me to? I'm gonna actually show you that it works and everything. You got. Uh, of course, you're gonna need the Void Launcher. You're gonna need your own client, and you're gonna need this. So I'm gonna turn this on. I'm probably gonna have to cut it because it takes forever for me to load. Put my password in. Go here. Crazycraft 3.1 play. So what's just funny is that my server turns on faster than my actual client the side game run. And I'll show you guys when it's done. Okay guys, we're back and um, as you can see it says it's done. Refresh, it's right there. If you port forwarded properly, if you just double click localhost or your IP address, you should just get right in. It 
should work fine. See, as you see, let me join the match. And we're in. So thanks for watching. If you guys want to join my server, I'll probably leave it in the um, description. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe if this helped. It crashed because it's crazy crash and it's crazy. No, it didn't crash. But uh, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. And uh, I am.